Hey guys, welcome back to Battle Cats. In the last episode, we completed Diver City in Uncanny Legends, and now I am all the way up to Ancient Forest Labyrinth, where we're gonna defeat and unlock Elder Mask Doran. All right, so the first level is called the Ivy Sealed Door. Six enemies, who are they? Oh, well, that doesn't actually seem that bad to me. So the chapter I just completed was the one that introduces Rage and Gory, although I've already fought him before. One thing you need to know about this guy, he cannot be frozen, so you can't use Bomber Cat on him. So since we can't freeze Rage and Gory, apparently the best unit to use here is Rodeo Cat, because Rodeo Cat can slow him instead. We also wanna have a little bit of wave immunity. Obviously, I already know that Octopus is great, okay? I don't think I want Coconut Head here. I'm not actually sure what else to put in here, guys. How about you and then like something really strong, really good against black. Obviously like an Uber or a legend. Do I even have any legends that are good against black? Red and Floating, Angel, uh, Traded. Well, technically, you know, Traitless, Traitless and Traded. Okay, nothing that's individually anti-black. I want a good anti-black Uber. I don't feel like there's a lot of good options here, guys. This one might knock back and slow black. It also has a target relic, which doesn't matter here, of course, but uh, yeah, you know what? I could give Vars another go. It's been a while. Every level in this chapter except the last level has a friggin' surge base on it. In it. Uh-oh, guys, Raging Gory's here and I wasn't paying any attention. Gotta kill this guy. <laughs> okay, he's dead. He's not that hard to kill, especially if you have, you know, pizza on Can Can. Oh boy, there is the frickin' bear. Is this one of those levels where I need to bring a cat combo? Here's Vars. There goes that guy. Do we just need to get over there now? We just need to scoot on, wait, oh no. Did I, oh boy, I did. I sent out Yukimura at the worst time and he just ran right into the surge. Ouch. Sorry, dude. Oh, there's another bear. I think I need to... You know what? I'm gonna do it right now. I need to put the cat cannon on the space bar button. Yeah, we're gonna make that the space bar. That oughta do. Thank you. Look, I'm not a huge fan of panicking and trying to hit that button while trying to hit all the other buttons as well. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully the space bar comes in handy. I just did the dumbest thing ever, guys. I really hope there are no more. Oh God, it's an assassin! That was close. Okay, I used up my cannon when I shouldn't have. Come on, Yukimura, you got this. Boom, we did an attack. And hopefully the surge does not land anywhere near him. Yeah, baby. Oh, we're, we're getting it. We're getting it now. Yeah. Way to go, Yukimura, you survived right up until the end. Hey, hey, I mean, the first the first one died, and I think the second one died. They all died except for you, but way to go, you! That was fun. Reincarnation ring. Um, ah, uh, okay. A good chance to use some anti-red units and uh, maybe a little bit of anti-traitless. Actually, you know what? Since there's a surge base in here, guys, I think I'm gonna go for my special little boy over here, Gato Amigo. It means cat friend, guys. He's my cat friend. Now listen, I don't know if Dark Laser's gonna work here, but Dark Laser does target red, and I thought maybe the wave attacks might be nice. There are two cats that I absolutely, absolutely want to have in my loadout for this fight, guys. You can probably guess what one of them is. One of the best cats in the whole game. I'm talking about, uh, come on, I'm just trying to scroll to it. I'm talking about Courier Cat, and I want Neo Cutter Cat, a really great cat to have when you got a red anteater, in my opinion. Now for the last one, guys, I think I'm gonna go anti-traitless here because there are a couple of traitless uh, enemies in this stage. I kinda wanna use Akuma. Akuma doesn't always work, but uh, he is level 45, okay? Every time I see that 45, I'm like, mmm, I want that. Okay, here we go. Just a couple little red units out here. Let me just go ahead and boom. Oh, what? When I say boom, you better kill. If all we're getting right now is this guy, I'm gonna... Oh, wow. Thanks a lot. Uh, maybe I should put something in front. Just a little something. 
Look at this guy. He doesn't care. He's just walking on over here and smacking us with that horn of his. There he goes. Okay, I'm leveling up. I ain't even in a rush. <laughs> Look at all those poor units dying over here. Okay. I'm gonna let this thing come to my base. I'm gonna hit him with the old Akuma. Boom! You like that? I know you like that. Okay, so that anteater, as per usual, is being a giant jerk. We're also probably gonna have some trouble with these reindeer, I think. It's kinda tough having anteaters and reindeer in the same level, guys. I'm not gonna lie, I do not want. If we kill like even one thing, we'll probably get enough money to keep going, right? Well, that's a big if, I suppose. Can you just do something? Where is your damage, bruh? Do the damage! Okay, nice wave attack. Nice, but 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 not nice enough, of course. Of course. Uh, what was that? Okay. Hey, Akuma. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna try the same thing again, but with Gao. Okay, I know I have other options as well, but Gao at least is higher than my average Uber in level. Here's how I'm gonna beat this stage, okay? First of all, I ain't gonna do anything. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a little something, obviously. I'm not gonna do absolutely nothing. It's just that I know that if I go too crazy, I'm gonna wake up the old base. Okay, I don't wanna wake up the base. I don't wanna wake up all the stuff in the base. So Can Can pretty much dies whenever the surge base attacks. So it's good to have a Can Can out here. Okay, that's dead. Level up a bunch. Hopefully. Yep, come on, wait for it. Boom. No, Can Can, stop! Okay, that was close, guys. I thought. I thought Can Can was gonna activate the rest of this. I'm not ready, okay? If anything, right now I'm putting out pizzas. Because pizza is nice and slow. This guy got nowhere to go. Look at him. Taking his time. Okay, let's just send it all out now. I kinda wish I had a uh, cat CPU at this point, but it's cool. It's cool. I actually think it might have been a bad idea for me to send everything out, because now the surge base might destroy me. We'll see what happens. We need to rely on Gao here to get rid of this reindeer, but the reindeer is actually hitting Gao. I hate that. I hate that. Well, we're way farther up, guys. We've killed one of the units. Oh my god, Gao, that was that was hurting, dude. That was hurting. Ah. Okay, Pizza actually managed to hit one of the reindeer then. That was great because, you know, Pizza packs a punch. It's just that Pizza has a hard time getting close enough. Luckily, we also have our uh, our Cutter Cat to do damage. And it's been working. Come on, guys. More, more wave attacks, please. We're so close. We're so close. Come on. Okay. I think... I think I don't want Pizza no more. I actually am not sure if that's a good idea or not. How about we take out Dark Laser and put in something useful? I'm having so much fun with Cutter, I'm thinking I might as well just throw in a bullet train as well and let the two of them go bang, 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 you know? I want a cat CPU, okay? There's too much clicking in this stage. Especially once you get all the money saved up, like what, come on, come on, man. Okay, it's definitely gonna take him a hot minute to get through all this stuff, so that's good. Uh, yeah, I'll just send out some pizzas for a second and let's get started on the stuff, baby. Yee! Oh! Don't hit that surge, that's a bad thing. And go. Alright, now I don't need to do nothing, guys. So if it all works out, then, uh... That'll be great. I know it might be a good idea for me to, like... Oh, God, what the heck happened there? How did you guys do that? How come it was all, like, good and then it wasn't good? Well, it's not terrible. We've got some... We've got some stuff happening, right? And we've got some damage being done. Yeah! Yeah, this is great! It's cool, man! We got that... That maglev, guys. The bullet train. Courier just did some damage to the uh, reindeer guys, which is great. I really just need to take out that reindeer. We just did a little chop on the anteater, which is cool. Waiting, waiting for something to, come on, come on. Oh no, I saw the slime miss there. I was really hoping that would have hit. We're good, we're good guys. We're getting a little hurt, but like very soon this guy's gonna die. I just know it. Very, very soon. He dead, okay. Now we just need to just keep going, okay? Just, just keep going. Yes! Okay. Yeah! Okay. Okay, so far so good. 
That one was harder than the first one. Now we're at Relief Towers. Seven enemies. I don't know how I feel about this stage, guys. I don't think I feel good things about it. Honestly, guys, this is really just an anti-alien loadout with some critters put in, so... Here's my anti-alien loadout. I don't think I need this. So let's just get three good critters. Send them on their way. Okay, so we got Catasaurus, which is a great critter. Use them all the time. Curry's good because he's got good range, and Paladin is an uber critter, which is always nice. So maybe between the three of them, we'll be okay. Wait, wait a second. Do we need this? I don't, I don't think we do. But I'll, I'll, I'll let you be, because I'm not sure. Oh boy, that super metal hippo's coming out quick. This guy got no time to waste. That's okay. You're gonna be okay, you guys are gonna pop up. Make sure you pop pop. Very important. If not, we're pro probably gonna lose. Don't make me get a, uh, what's it called in here? You know the what's it called? It's called, um... I can't remember. Hoop Cat! I was thinking about Hoop Cat, guys, but, uh, we, we maybe don't need him. Okay. Here comes the fun. The seal, guys. That seal is a lot of trouble. But when Paladin gets a good smack on him, it ain't so bad. He already killed the Super Metal Hippo like it was nothing. Pop, pop, baby. Pop, pop, Uber carry. Let's go. Okay, there you go. Paladin has succeeded and we'll send it Aphrodite now and that should take care of the, uh, of the big boy. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that, everybody's dying. Everybody's dead. Yeah. Way to go, Kitty of Liberty, it was, it was all you. You know you're doomed if there's a can can knocking on your door, okay? It's like the number one rule of Battle Cats now. Fly through the air, there we go. Curry saves the day. Canopy Altar, five enemies. Hey look, it's Reynard again, guys. Oh, Reynard, so difficult. Reynard melts as soon as you bring a can can near it. It's pretty hilarious. Uh, so we got floating, red, angel, and relic. Kind of gross. It's really hard not to absolutely adore Bankai, guys. Any situation where I get a chance to use Bankai is a good situation. Okay. That was a bad idea, dude. Why did you do that? I forgot slapsticks! What am I gonna do now? I'm gonna have to kill this relic doge some other way. And there he is, folks. Oh! So we got, like... Lots of surging happening now, huh? Okay. Fishman! Kill it, Fishman! Kill it now! Okay. Got through one. Reynard's dead. That was the easiest part. I already told you that. I'm, I'm just chilling. Okay, I'm just gonna keep leveling up. Because hopefully, they'll keep us away. Nope, they didn't. Okay, it's cool. It's cool. Here's Bankai. And Fishman. Bankai Fishman. And you. Snip, snip, snip. And let's go, Bankai. Boom! You're dead. Watch out for the surges. They're not nice, but you're gonna be okay, right? Alright, got that range. Keep on smacking. Oh! We did it. Okay. I think that was the main threat here, guys. I'm not 100% on that one, but, you know. I know that the main threat ain't Raynard. Usually once you get all the way to the base, it's pretty good. If we could get a can-can in here. Yeah, there goes the can-can. It's all over now, can-can's here. Mm. I don't even know if they can surge that close to the base. Anyway, another one bites the dust, guys. Wow. Sappy underpass. Okay. That's, uh, that's, that's probably what I would give myself if I wanted me to have a bad time. Again, guys. It's not that big of a deal to get zombies. I just don't like them. So we need anti-zombie. And I've got a few anti-zombies that I like to use in these situations, as you already know. And, uh, the, you know, the main one, of course, is Shigong. We'll keep our anti-red in here. We can take out our anti-floating. Gonna need our boy Courier Cat in here. But I'm not really sure. I think I need to get rid of this. Because we're gonna want something decent. I think maybe just Amaterasu because Amaterasu has that, you know, good against everything and zombie killer. Let's see if this is enough. Let's go, sappy underpants. More like crappy underpants, am I right? Got him. Great. Thank you, I love Zalos. Who's coming here? All kinds of stuff. We need to get our courier in. 
to attack that guy. Okay. Gonna want this guy out here too. Snip. It's all about the snips, baby. Oh, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna send out that before I'm a Terrasu, I think, because that just tunneled, didn't it? Oh, baby. Uh, there you are. Actually, you know, it's probably not a big deal. You want to tunnel, you can. It's not gonna make my life that much harder. Whatever. CPU time, guys. I'll make a few clicks here and there just to make sure the meat shields keep going. It is a bit of a concern what's happening back here, guys. That, uh, that gravestone could be the death of us if not dealt with properly, and it's hard to properly deal with it. It's very, it's very quick to attack. And it gets around us and then we're doomed. Come on, where is it? Don't you, where, where'd you go? There you are, oh! Don't do that, don't, don't do that. I wanna say the best option here is to put out a weed whacker, but it also might be good to put out an ecto weight so we can push it back. Freezing and pushing it back would both be good, so I think I'm gonna use both. I'll take out Cyberpunk. Probably not gonna work that well. He doesn't work as well in zombie levels because of the way the front lines work, you know, all the tunneling and whatnot. This is good. This is fine. Let's see how things go against the zombies now. Need more money for sure, but we'll save up a little bit. Um, that gravestone, it's just gonna be hard to deal with. It's just, it's just gonna be annoying. But we're doing a nice freeze on it there, and the freeze is, you can't beat it, okay? You can't beat a freeze on an enemy that's constantly tunneling. We don't need to kill the, the gravestone if we can just keep it away from us a little longer. See, look at that. Don't you, ah! I am too lazy to come up with a different plan, just rich cat. Here, you, you do it, game. I don't wanna do it, you do it. Okay, maybe, maybe I need to play a little bit, guys because although the CPU isn't gonna steal my money and put it into my wallet, it might still make dumb moves, okay? Ding, ding, ding! Okay, I think we're pretty much set up here now. Things are uh, going. Where is, there it is. It's popping up for a it's frozen. Love it when it freezes, so good. But man, there's just not enough happening here. The CPU, the CPU runs out of money eventually, guys, very sad. Very sad. Come on, keep it going, that's great, yes! Okay, the the Ecto Weight's doing a great job here, guys. Because it's just really good at knocking back. Oh, we're hitting the base now. If we can just not die here now, we'll be okay. I'm afraid to look. Oh, it's going well, it's going really well. Come on, pizza! Show them what you got, pizza, because it's very scary here. Yes! Okay. Hey, I guess the rich cat strat worked. Lazy strat, but sometimes lazy strats are what you need. They're what I need, because I'm lazy. Okay, now the face of God. Who's ready to see the face of God? I'm not. 3% chance to get Elder Mask Doran. He's gonna be fighting, he, he's, a, he's a relic by the way. Um, he's gonna be fighting with an Owl, Sloth, Croconator, Rage and Gory. That's not that bad. Croconators seem to go well with uh, wave attacks, so let's have a wave attack. Well, we have two wave attackers in here technically, so that's cool. Uh, we can take out, you know, some of the anti-red stuff and the anti-zombie stuff. Yo, what up, baby boo? What are you doing, baby girl? You thought you were just gonna get in here and run away from me and I wasn't gonna pick you up and stick you in front of the camera and beg, beg the viewers to smash the like button. Did you think? Yeah. Yeah, you did. <laughs> she sounds like she's in pain or something. Oh, the man is kissing me. All right, so we gotta deal with the gory. Best thing we can do here is just have the rodeo cat. I don't really think we need anything else if we have pizza and can can. Probably gonna want another meat shield. Not sure, but let's assume we do. Floating, I don't know how much trouble we're gonna have with the owl, probably none. Usually can can's great with owls, it gets you lots of money. So I'm wondering what else I need. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take Saki, okay? So we can do a little, uh, a little snipe on this thing. Okay, aliens and relics. I think that's probably the best. Uh, yeah, it's aliens and something. Okay, so we'll just target the relic. We're just gonna target uh, Elder Flame Doron. I mean, I don't even know what we're getting ourselves into, guys. Here, have a future cat. Sniper might help. 
depending on how the boss actually behaves, which I, I just don't know, okay. I was thinking about putting an anti-traitless in here, guys, but I think I'm just gonna throw a bullet train in, just for fun. We'll probably have to come back to this loadout once I find out what's difficult about Doron. I don't think I need a cat CPU here. Let's go. Okay. Oh my god, he coming out fast! You better get back! You better- Oh god, he's immune! Ah! What did you do? What did you- Ah! Oh! Oh! What just happened? Where'd he go? Why he back over there? Oh lord. Oh, is that just- Okay. I get it. He hits us, loses his face, and then uh, runs away. That's a- That's a weird strat, man. What the heck? That's- <laughs> Is that like a kamikaze sort of situation? Did you just kamikaze over here? How do we even attack Doron? Is that a thing? Do we need to attack Doron? What is happening? I'm not complaining. I, mean, I feel like we're doing just fine, right? But here comes another one. Stop, Doron. So the question is, can I even use Saki here? Because I don't even know how the... I've never seen an enemy that works like this. Oh, I'm going to attack you and then just die or something. We need to do a friggin' wave. How have we not done any wave attacks? Thank you. Level it up. Let's go. Okay, we're we're on the struggle bus, guys. We are on the struggle bus. But the struggle bus has not reached its destination yet. There is still time to get off the struggle bus before it does. Those surges are killing me. I need something for the surge, man. I need to... Stop it! Stop it! That was weird. That was really weird. I do not want Croconators getting in my way. We cannot do anything to Doron with that thing, so let's forget it. I'm gonna put in something that will do some waves. What? Are you back? What now? Nothing. Not- you don't want anything. Yeah, you- Hey, look at me! I'm gonna go lie down in my little window! Ooh, I'm a cat! Meow! Or something. We're fighting a legend unit. I'm gonna use a legend unit against it, guys. Grandmaster is great for doing waves. So, maybe, just maybe, it'll help with the Croconators. I think maybe it might be a good idea to have this stuff on, too. We're probably not ready to beat it yet, but I'm gonna put it on anyway, just to make it a little easier on me. But first, can you- can you stop? Not ready. Not ready for that. That was fun. I gotta tell you, these these gorillas are ruining my day. Ugh. I took out Grandmaster. I'm putting in Gato Amigo again. Okay, maybe with some more meat shields, it'll be different. I won't waste all of my rich cats and CPUs, I promise. So the hope is that if we have something that's immune to the surge, it will just help a little bit in terms of how badly they are able to push us back. At least now, when the Surge comes, it won't get everything. Surge immunity is quite useful. We're holding them back a lot better this time as well. And I don't have to do anything. Just gotta ask Doron to stop doing whatever the heck he's doing. Beautiful, beautiful, look at that! Ain't no problems here, man, ain't no, ain't no problems. I don't, I don't know if it's the Gato Amigo that's helping now, guys, but we are, we're holding off way better. We don't even need to kill Doron. That's not even a thing. We just need to break the base. I don't even I don't even think you can attack Doron. Saki, do something. Saki, I don't even know why I got you in here. Okay. Doron just hit again, guys. We got a couple of gorillas, but if we can get through these gorillas, we can start hurting the base. And Saki can actually hit the base. Don't forget that. I forgot that, but don't you forget that. Saki can hit the base and do some decent damage as well, which is pretty great. It's like 100k. Maybe 90, somewhere around there. Okay, that's how things are done here, okay? Doron, welcome to the neighborhood. Enjoy your stay. Gosh. I did not get him. It was only a 3% chance. Here, why don't you try again? Is that three gorillas? Come on, guys. Just, just give up. Stay home, okay? Just, just stay home next time. Wing! Go with Doron. Special Cat Elder Mask Doron received, activated at the upgrade menu, and some Beast Bones for you! And my Enigma decoding level is now 8. 
Don't know how that happened. Elder Mass Doran, ancient hero now allied with the trendy cats. Redesigned his look without telling his parents. 100% freeze versus relic, single surge attack. Doran, let's, let's go all the way to level 10. Crazy, I know. Cat Mass Doran. Okay. Well, I need to have a look. There it is, folks. Elder Mass Doran. Wow. Wow, we look at that. <laughs> so embarrassed when you lose your mask. Do it again. Crazy charge attack, mask explodes. Oh my god, my face! I don't want them to know I have a face! Cat Mask Doran, sick of being tied down by family traditions, he expresses his true self with a new cat mask. Look at that. Boop. Ah! <laughs> 100% freeze versus relic, single surge attack. Now, there, there, there's a true form of this, guys. Uh, in order to get it, you need to beat something later on down the line, I think. There's a certain stage you need to complete, and then you get the true form. True form added in version 12. That was very recently, so it's probably gonna be difficult to get. Evolves at level 30 using behemoth stones and XP after completing atonement for sin. Oh! Jeez, you have to beat a level in the final chapter of Uncanny Legends for that. So it's gonna take me a minute, guys. We're at chapter 37 now, out of 48. My question is, now that I've got Doran, what are they gonna show on the menu when I come to the legend stages? Let's find out. Oh my, what is that? Stage clear bonus nine. Clear the final stage of Behemoth's Peak for a small chance to unlock the special cat Elder Beast Nala. Okay, well, apparently that's coming up at some point, guys. Probably not gonna be in the near future because I feel like whatever stage they just mentioned is far away. Okay, it's not that bad. It's in the 43rd subchapter of Uncanny Legend, so it's only six more chapters away. All right, guys, so there you go. Elder Mass Doran has been unlocked. Progress has been made in the Battle Cats. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and if you wanna check out another one of my videos, do it. Check it out.